Hi everyone, it's Jennifer at Art Life Redo. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I'll be painting a watermelon mandala on a record. But before we create, please click subscribe and that notification bell so you can watch more videos like this. I had the idea of this watermelon mandala for a collab that I used to be a part of on Instagram. I joined because I thought it was a great way for me to get in touch with my art again as it forced me to do something each week and out of my comfort zone. This initial drawing was drawn with my Macron pens. This particular record that I'm painting on is a 12 inch RCA Victor. It's Moonlight Cocktail with Glenn Miller and his orchestra. So this particular record was recorded during World War II, the day after the attack on Pearl Harbor. The music was composed by Lucky Roberts with lyrics by Kim Gannon. Now that I have a few painted records under my belt, I found an easier way to prep the records. Normally, when you're using acrylic paint, it could take up to five to six coats to give me a good base to paint on with a record. But to save some time, I now prep the records by spray painting either with white, black, or tan. I found that it absorbs my acrylic paint as it dries a lot faster, especially when I use the apple barrel paints. So mandalas have been widely used for meditation purposes in traditional cultures. So the idea is to be able to distress and find inner peace through art and comfortable drawing. This is how I look at my art. It's a time for me to relax and de-stress. I work a full-time job while trying to raise a family. When I can find time for any type of art, whether it's painting, drawing, coloring, stained glass, etc., I'm at my most inner peace. I think everyone needs something like that in their life. And it could be writing, exercise, dancing, meditation. What brings you the most joy in your life? So here's the finished piece. Leave me a comment and don't forget to like this video, click subscribe and the notification bell. And as always, thanks for watching and I hope you have a very creative day.